afternoon everybody I'm coming to you with a video that I'm doing up right now that I'm quite excited about but was a little bit nervous about too um, we've been going through a few rugs lately as everybody's aware and even today uh, I don't know if you have uh, been told about it yet but hope uh, rugged this was I think a tomb fork or something I didn't really know anything about it uh, I was just on a call with a couple of uh, buddies on a uh, a private discord that I'm in and we ended up uh, hearing about it right real time and started uh, throwing some information off to some people kind of trying to hunt it down it looks like about 1.8 million was um, taken through tornado cash and uh, yeah really really unfortunate uh, sorry if you were involved in it at all or, or sorry uh, invested in it at all but uh, anyways it, it is what it is um, so I was a little bit nervous about trying to do a video like this but thought you know what this is how some people get into DeFi and we need to learn from it. We need to be intelligent on how we uh, spread our capital and how we um, do that. And hopefully this will help bring some value to how you can approach this market. Uh, if you're new or existing um, or are almost starting over based on uh, on maybe some wrong turns you've made, uh, I'm hoping this will help either show how to do it right or if this fails, show how not to do it or how to maybe think about it differently and maybe change or pivot your habits and stuff. Um, so what I've decided to do is do this very clean, hopefully, um, opportunity where I'm going to invest $1,000 into four different projects. Spoiler alert, they're on the screen there. Um, I've chosen them almost at, I wouldn't say random completely, but um, Fathom are making some changes. I think there's some announcements coming soon. Um, I do like their idea. And I thought maybe it would be a neat one to kind of play with and show some income producing opportunities because I do like the team, their docs, all this KYC, all this stuff. PGV, I think it's pretty obvious why that one's on there. Uh, always good to have somebody that's that's stable that seems to be doing well, uh, seem to be making a difference in the space. Uh, Wolf Capital was a fun one I just got into recently. Um, I've gotten probably, a, I've never really gotten a lot of negative comments to be honest with you about my videos. Uh, I did get a couple on this one. I think some people feel maybe it's a little bit degen or whatever, um, but I'm curious on where it's gonna go. And because of its return, it's a fairly quick and easy um, ROI kind of thing. And that's, what I'm looking at here is some of these are uh, the 0.5%, uh, 2% uh, variable ta or rates kind of thing, some of them variable like PGV and stuff. And the whole idea here is to build a table. And this table has to have as strong legs, legs as we can. And right now, they're fairly weak. We only have four legs. If one breaks, that's a quarter. Um, so my whole philosophy around this whole challenge, 1K challenge, is to kind of create, hopefully, a table of eight legs is my goal. And so we're going to grow this and take these four investments and all the income I earn from them uh, on a weekly or whatever basis. Once I've got another 250, I'll create another table leg. Once I have another 250, another table leg. Once we've created our eight table legs, then we're going to ROI, uh, ROI our 1K and be dealing with all risk capital. And this is what we're talking about when we say risk capital. These are the funds that you don't have, uh, that you that are not, uh, you've, you've earned them back already. You've already made your money. Everything you earn in here or everything you lose in here is bonus money, I guess, if you will, in that case. Um, so we're gonna start it this week. I'm gonna try and do this weekly. Uh, the dates may change on when I do it, but I'll try and keep it as consistent as I can. And we'll go through every, every week showing what we have, and hopefully as we add new legs, it'll get a little bit more exciting. Uh, if you'd like to have a say in what legs I kind of add, I, I'm not gonna say I'm gonna listen to everybody's choices, but my Telegram is probably a great place to go. Um, quickly into, before I get into this, obviously this is not financial advice. Um, please do your own research on any of these projects. As I said, I kind of, so uh, Fathom Finance, like I said, I'm feeling confident what they might do. PGV, also confident. Um, obviously, we're going through these these refunds right now, and it can be scary, but I, he's been doing them, and we'll hopefully see more of them done soon and get through that. And Wolf Capital, I think, is fairly new, so it's a good little one to go into. This one here is kind of a... Uh, actually, it was on the chat today with... Um, it's in part of Jack's passive income, his uh, uh, D, DeFi private group. And um, we kind of threw out a couple of ideas. Some didn't kind of fit with the plan, and then this one came out. It's a fairly low yield, 3% uh, a week. And um, so we're just kind of putting that in, hopefully to be a stable place to go. Um, I don't know a whole lot about it. Like I said, I kind of just jumped in and chose this along, along with this group. So we'll see how this all goes. Um, so without any further ado, let's start going through the transactions and we'll see me set these up live. Um, I did already move funds into a stable investment because I wanted, they take a few minutes to get in there and I wanted to make sure it was uh, ready to go. But basically I now have, oh, I think I'm on the wrong wallet. Uh, YouTube challenge. 
So I've got 215 BUSD, which will be going into Fathom, and I have 500 here to go into Wolf Capital and Prosperity Gem, and uh, I have my other one already in there. The other 250 is already in there. The other thing I want to add here and very important is I am not going to be putting any referral codes for this wallet. Um, I will put some referral codes. If you'd like to use them, great. If you don't, don't. Don't necessarily copy what I'm doing. I'm more looking at this for a general idea of how you could approach uh, the DeFi space and how you could approach some of these riskier plays. And then hopefully in turn, what we'll do over time is we'll take some of this money out and put it into uh, maybe some L1s as we grow it um, and, and see how we go with this. Like once we get kind of 2x our money, maybe after we've taken our risk capital out, maybe we'll take 250 and, and put it into different tokens that we'll hold on to, um, like Matic or whatever, to kind of hopefully see if they appreciate it. So it, there's lots of neat things we can do with this. Happy for you to come along and, and, and maybe have some input. Uh, like I said, best place is my Discord. So sorry, babbling a lot. Um, so let's go 250. Um, so I'm not using it. There is a shilling school that's going to be coming out here. I will put my uh, regular Fathom uh, wallet uh, in there if people do want to get into Fathom. Uh, I don't think it's available yet or it's about to be available. Um, so there's that. Um, so Fathom is what we're buying. So we're getting a whole bunch of Fathom because the price has gone down. I'll show that a little bit. As we go on, hopefully I can show you more details on how this works and we'll see it as I, as I invest in it real time to make it a little bit easier. So we're going to put 250 in. Approve. Obviously, usual fangs. And again, like and subscribe. If you guys do like this content, like the idea behind this whole um, little video that I'm doing, please uh, make some comments in the video itself. And again, come by my disc, my Telegram, and let's have a chat about it all. And so we've approved that. Uh, the whole idea, hopefully, here is by diversifying in the four. Like I said, if one goes down, uh, then we're not so bad. So we've approved it. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go straight to buy and stake. Uh, that way it's going to start earning right away. And hopefully with some of the new plans, the price will maybe appreciate and stuff. So buy and stake does give you a little higher gas, just something to note. I'm presuming that's because of the two transactions it's doing, um, because it's not doing it all on one. And I think it does spread it out in a few places, so all those little things end up adding to the transactions. So, And that's the one thing, it's hard to really show what gas I'm spending on this, but in the most part, again, this whole spreadsheet I'll try and make as transparent as I can. So that basically did um, that. So now we've got our 250 in there. Obviously this one will be pretty easy and this one will be pretty easy. This one here does give you a little bit of a bonus money right to start off with. Um, so we'll be going ahead and, and, and um, staking that and uh, we'll go from there. So with this one, we're doing the USDC because that's the only contract we want to get into right now. Um, so it's showing my USDC is there. And so we're gonna go down here and hunt, so 250. Uh, you can't put decimals in here, something to keep in mind. Uh, and some people have asked about this. So this is the balance in the contract, um, like the sitting in the contract. These are the total gems available. And then this is the gem bots that are active and contract pumps that have happened. Uh, and then total refunds that have gone through, so quite a few, and how many people, how many harvested gems there have been. Um, the first little bit, there's a little glitch here. It shows you that uh, it kind of goes back and forth sometimes, but normally it shows after the first week of deposits. Once you've done your first um, harvest, it'll always give you fairly accurate information there. Um, so I don't want to do max. This is a new thing with um, with uh, MetaMask. You can actually tell it what you want to approve it for. So we're going to just do that. Oh, that's numbers only. There we go. Next, so we're just giving it permission for just that 250, not giving it permission for a ton and ton of money. Um, and so we're hunting gems. So it's got two transactions. One is to approve the transaction, and now we're confirming the transaction. And then we should be able to go into account once it's done. All right. And waiting, waiting, waiting. There we go. And it might not show right this second, but if I reload the website, just do a little enter. Uh, there we go. Sometimes if you don't see stuff like that, hold the shift button and hit enter. It'll do a hard refresh. Uh, oftentimes when you're dealing with Web3 uh, websites, adapts, I find they don't always go right away. But there we are. So now we've got our second done. So nice and easy. And then this one here, we're going to do the same. Now with this one here, actually I'm going to pause for a second. I am going to grab my, uh, I'm going to be part of my Wolf Capital team as a second player in here, because uh, why not? It helps my team out. And uh, as we grow this, it'll help the Wolf Pack that I've already created and stuff. So I'm going to go grab that um, link so I can make this accurate. 
All right, some people were asking this on my channel when I did the Wolf Pack, um, Wolf Capital uh, video. So what you're going to see is as long as the, the code is here, the referral code, so that's my wallet from my main wallet, uh, then you're going to end up getting added to the Wolf Pack once you do your deposit. So you're not going to get it right away. Um, so we're going to do 250 here. Oops, I'll just keep that out and deposit. So same thing here. Wait for MetaMask to wakey wakey. And there will be a little bit of a bonus, I think, that this wallet will get of 1.5% of what I put in. Um, so there will be a little bonus we get right away, but we'll start earning money on the full amount. Or approve. There we go. And then we'll have to go and stake, I believe, if I remember correctly. It was a couple of days ago. So we'll wait for that to go. So hopefully with these four things, um, like I said, hopefully we'll get lucky and we'll be able to ROI on all of them before anything happens. But this is DeFi, you never know. Uh, what projects should you pick? Obviously do your own research, take a peek at what makes you comfortable. Um, so there's probably the stake afterwards. Um, and figure out what, what works for you. Uh, there There's tons of other pro projects you could do. Some are limited by like some people said, oh, you should do um, FX Gold, Master Gold. Uh, but the thing is, you kind of need 300. Really, you kind of need 600 to start in that. And I didn't want to um, kind of cut people off at certain things. I want to make this as open as possible. Most of these are minimum 50 or $100. Uh, so it makes it a little bit more approachable for people if you're spreading out maybe a smaller amount than 1,000. Um, so as you can see, obviously, my 10% comes off. So we're already a little bit behind the eight ball on this one. Um, and what I will probably do is... Uh, possibly compound or claim yeah i guess it's only claiming on this one so we're going to claim get our 250 out regardless of of the uh, staked amount and go from there so it's already staked for us it's already earning and um i think if you go over here we should see dashboard maybe lottery so there's our stake daily earnings 2.25 total staked and we're yeah so we've gone into the the uh, Pocket Aces Crypto Wolf Pack, and we're now up to 11 members. And uh, we can then do, 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 unstake, oh, claim. So we'll be able to claim there. I thought there was something that you get for joining the Wolf Pack, like 1.5%, but maybe it doesn't show right away. Oh, there we go. Total, total referral bonus. So I got to remember how to my referrals. But I so I got that's my 1.5%, I think, is what I get there. So I don't know exactly where that went, but apologies. Um, so this one here is a little different. So what I've done is I've already set up the account. As you can see, they bump you up a little bit. So you get $5 for setting up the account, and then you get um, another uh, chunk for the amount that you put in. Uh, and then I'm assuming there might be something for you for the referral codes and stuff. I've set up a separate account where I put the minimum $100 in, and that's where I'll put a, set up my referral code if you choose to use it. Again, please... Uh, I'm not here to make a million dollars on the referral codes. To be honest with you, what I might do is the referral codes I earn, I might even do some givebacks during the future weekly episodes of this because um, I'm not looking to get rich off of the referral codes. But if you would like to support the channel, sort of, as well as possibly support some some giveaways that we'll do, uh, then by all means, don't hesitate to use my referral codes for these projects that I'm doing. But those referral codes are going to a separate wallet so that this will have full transparency of what you can do uh, when you aren't a, a YouTuber influencer or whatever the hell you want to call me. Um, so I want to make sure that that's very clear and very transparent. So we're actually putting in 257.05. So so with this one here, 257.5, we're already kind of up on our thing, but this one here, technically we're down to two point uh, 225 because of the 10%. Um, I think that's right, right? I'm losing it. Yeah, 225. So we're we're still overall down right now, but we're gonna see how that'll progress through the through the things. So with this, I didn't go through all the details, but basically you have to put in some information for the account. There is an email that gets sent to you. You have to do your normal song and dance kind of thing. There's date of birth, all that stuff. I don't think I put accurate anything, to be honest with you. Um, and it seems to all just go through. Um, what you then do is you do click on deposit. You can choose Tron or, I believe it's Tron or BSC, but Basically, you just choose USDC or USDT. I think I did USDT and continue to deposit. It's going to, oh, yeah, to put an amount, so 100, continue to deposit. Um, it'll bring this up, and then you can confirm and pay, and it'll give you a wallet address that you send the money to. Um, it says it can take up to 24 hours. I think it only took me a tiny bit of time before I got it in, so it was super, super quick and super easy. Um, and then basically what you'll do is our plans, 
and you'll go invest now. So until we get up to a thousand dollars, which maybe we'll do with this wallet, let's we'll have to see what happens as we once we ROI. Like I said, we might compound a bit as well as create those other legs and then grow our legs. And maybe we'll get up to a thousand. We'll start earning four percent. Uh, who knows what will happen down the road? Uh, but for now, it's one month, and you get uh, three percent a week. And so we're going to invest in this one for now. Uh, so silver plan, we're going to choose 257.50. Oh, it's funny, USDT and USDC are a tiny bit off. Um, main wallet and USDT. So we will continue to invest. Confirm and proceed. So pretty easy. Uh, the DAP is pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Uh, once you go to investments, you're going to see your funds invested down here. So you can create different um, plans if you wanted as you reinvest more or whatever. Um, I don't know if there's actually a compound. I think you have to just make separate ones. Um, so we'll see. And then it looks like there's a little transaction history and stuff like that. So that's kind of it. So we've made our, our three investments now, um, which is cool. We've got our little balance here uh, equal some of these guys. So there we go. We're down a tiny little bit right now. And we're going to see how that goes. Um, a little challenge out to anybody, honestly. I will pay someone 50 bucks if they want to create me a spreadsheet for this. Uh, obviously, come to my Discord and let me know. I'm not going to give everybody 50 bucks, so don't all come running in there at once. Uh, but if somebody wants to create me a, a, a spreadsheet for this and I end up using it on the channel, uh, then I'll, I'll give you 50 bucks for that uh, time and effort. So just a little gift to you for the time you might put in for me. So I appreciate that because um, I can probably make this look a little bit nicer. And maybe there's some other data that maybe we want to see as I'm going through it. Uh, if you feel good about that and you want to do something, don't waste too much time with it, though, because as I said, I'm just going to choose one. Um, so if I get a couple of really good ones, maybe I'll choose a random one uh, and we'll go from there um, I think that's pretty much everything uh, so thank you so much for having a peek at this one hopefully you like the kind of style that I'm going through with you here um, as we as we progress through it we'll take a peek at all four of these and see how they're doing and as I said if you'd like to have a say on what we maybe add to this wallet once our 250 is built up again uh, then let me know and we can try and see what we can do with that um, so as you can see right now here we're gonna have at the end of the month 30 bucks here so that'll be a part of our 250 the other one should perform better obviously there's a variable rate in here Right now it's at 1.25, uh, but that could go up or down depending on what happens. So we'll go through some challenges there, or some some strategies there. And then this guy here, um, I believe we can withdraw um, every seven days, if I'm not mistaken, without any huge, huge taxes. But there is a tax when we put it in. Um, so again, actually, I should have looked at that. We're probably down quite a bit more as well because of that. So, oh, there we go. We've earned a penny already. So look at that. Um, yeah, I can't remember how much is in there afterwards, but we'll take a look. Oh, there we go. Two, four. Uh, that's the mint, but I have to take a look. We'll take a look and we'll update the spreadsheet maybe with that because um, there is a little bit more complications of this one because you've got a token that we're dealing with. Um, but it's kind of neat how they use the dividend token. I will stop babbling. Um, so thank you so much, guys. Uh, as I said before, please do like and subscribe. We're over the 2,000 mark, which is absolutely amazing. So I appreciate that. Um, and, uh, and yeah, we're going to... We're going to see what we can do with this weekly challenge and uh, looking forward to hopefully bringing you some positivity here and hopefully some neat growth uh, and to look forward to any stories you guys have as you're going through uh, it, maybe something like this yourself. Uh, let me know what's worked for you or what hasn't. Uh, I'd love to hear that. Again, comments below always help that algorithm, help grow the channel and help keep the videos uh, performing, So, which I appreciate. Uh, and otherwise, Telegram is always a great place for now to reach out to me. DMs are getting a little crazy, um, so I will probably look at doing a Discord soon to kind of bring everybody in who would like to to be uh, in um, possibly a paid site I, I'm not sure yet I've got to figure this out I might as I said work with another youtuber that I'm talking to about doing one but we're trying to do a few things right now in the space to try and make it safer do our part uh, and so we'll keep going through stuff like that um, any questions let me know and have yourselves a great rest of your day